What's up guys, welcome back to The Educated Barfly. Today we're gonna to be doing an awesome, refreshing, amazing cocktail from Eric Castro called a Kentucky Buck. Now I've encountered a bunch of different uh, specs for this one. This one is a little bit of an adapted spec. I'm not really sure this is exactly what Castro did when he created it. And then also uh, I have uh, come into, like I've had the information that it was created at uh, Polite Provisions. Uh, which is where Eric Castro was running the program for a while. And he's also, I think, I think he's got an ownership stake in there. And then uh, it has also been done for, uh, and then also I, I got some information that it might've been uh, originally created for the Rick House, which is just another bar that Castro uh, has uh, consulted on uh, as well. Uh, I don't really know. It's a very nice um, kind of ginger forward uh, cocktail. So let's just get into it. I don't really have much to say about it. So first thing we're gonna do is you're just gonna cut the tops off a couple strawberries and throw them into our glass, glassy poo. You know what, actually, I'm gonna use these two because they're very ripe. You want ripe strawberries. These are very ripe. Like so ripe we need to use them and that's why I decided to create this cocktail. So I was like, I saw those in the fridge and I was like, you should probably use those. All right, next thing we're gonna do is uh, three quarters of an ounce of lemon juice. Half an ounce, half an ounce of ginger syrup, half an ounce of simple syrup. Then we're just gonna do two, ah, I keep on doing that. Marius has asked me to not call out the amount before I go like this, so that's easier for him to cut. And I've been trying very hard to keep to it, and I'm just such in the zone, and then also such in the habit of doing it the other way that I keep catching myself. All right, so here we go. For Marius, so that we don't, so that he has an easy time editing. Two ounces of bourbon. Today I decided to use my favorite workhorse bourbon. You can use what bourbon you like. I like the Evan Williams Bonded, it's very nice. It's a very nice bourbon and uh, it's one of my faves. So we're just gonna muddle up these strawberries. And a good old muddle poo, okay. Then we're gonna add ice to our glass. Ooh, that's a nice big piece. And ice to the big tin. Add our cocktail. Give it a nice shake. Ooh, I can feel that in my shoulder. All right, there we go. And then what we're gonna do is give it a nice double strain. I like to use larger volume glasses. Oh, you know what else I'd like to do as well? Well, there we go, got that. So now here's the deal. Ooh, nice, nice color, man, nice color. Um, so I have seen two different recipes for this drink. Uh, one calls for um, fresh ginger and topping it with soda, and then one calls for uh, no fresh ginger and topping it with ginger beer. I like actually using ginger, like fresh ginger and ginger beer uh, in this drink. Uh, I will say that if you uh, add the carbonation last, you wanna pour it off the ice because if you pour it on top of the ice, it's gonna layer on top. So you wanna kind of pour it right straight down to the bottom of the drink. And there we go. Then we're gonna just cut our garnish very quickly. So my garnish, I'm gonna be using a, these little bamboo toothpicks. I'm gonna put it through a piece of ginger candy. You kinda of wanna angle them in a little bit, not too far in, but like a little bit in so that it sits nicely on the glass. And then we're going to stick it through a strawberry. See if we can do this. And then you just wanna sit it on top of the glass right there. And there we have it. I have yet again forgotten my sippy cylinder. If you don't mind, I'm just gonna. Is that nice? Mm -hmm. Look at that a little yellow straw and a pink drink. Let's take a sip. Ooh, this is. I mean, doesn't this just look brilliant? Oh, ginger and strawberries, dude. That is an amazing combination. You got the ginger. You got the fresh strawberry. I gotta tell you, fresh ginger on ginger beer, I really like it. It's very gingery. 
Um, I don't think it's off balance. The, the strawberry just like kind of comes right through on the end. You've got the spiciness and the ginger that hits you right off the bat. I like using the 100 proof bourbon. It's a little bit um, spicier because it's just uh, gonna be hotter. And you got like the heat from the, from the proof of it. And then it's just like, you know, it, it really combines very well. This is like summer sipper. This is amazing. This is so good. So there you have it, my friends. The Kentucky Buck. Uh, if you like our channel, please hit like and subscribe and check us out on Patreon, patreon.com slash The Educated Barfly. I will see you guys on another time.